or to make the difference is in your thinking. You've got to understand that there is no money. Okay. If you don't that's understand that, that's a piece that, of the point that I'm getting you to. will go off on a wild right. goose chase like mm -hmm. everybody's on, like it's some money. But somewhere. see, that's what I've been asking people. Where's the money coming from? They don't know. I, I know, but I, I'm trying to inform them. Right, right. Saying, Where's right. the money coming right. from? They said, well, we're going to pay for it. I said, okay, wait a minute. The interviewee is. Tax, okay. We're supposed to pay for it with our taxes. Tax season this year is gone and that money spent. Tax season for next year ain't got here yet, so they ain't got the money yet. Where's the money coming from? Let me tell you the thing you is, it, it doesn't exist. It they got to print it or do whatever it's, you know, mm -hmm. digitize or whatever, whatever it's called. So it's, it's all quote unquote magic. <laughs> what it is, these are the best of times and they're the worst of times. It depends on where you are up here. Number one, you got to know who you are, you got to know where you are, and you got to know and understand there is no money. Nobody is using money anywhere in the world. Nowhere. If they are using paper currency, they, they're not using money. But that's not money. That's not money. And, and a lot of people don't understand that people still call it money, but it's not. It's cash. And what do the Chinese say? The beginning of wisdom is to call things by their by right by name. Right yep. That's it. That's where it all starts, knowing the name of things. The ancient Egyptians said in the Hussein, no beginnings. And you know where yet. All right then. When we flew, we flew heavy jets. We have an INS head, that is inertial navigation system. Mm -hmm. Before you can get to where you're going, you got to know where you are. And that's called your present position. Now you can you can load in all your coordinates in that head, but if you don't load present position, yeah, they don't you know where you, you as they said, they don't know they don't know where you're coming from. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know where you're going, but I don't know where you're coming from. <laughs> all right then. Present position. Present position. Where are we? So you know Zach, Hassan got all this juicy stuff. You know? <laughs> oh, yeah. Zach, Hassan, don't miss an opportunity. Let me, let me, let me, all let me, of them. Thank you. Talk and this all. and this. everybody think that that's the way court's supposed to go. Now, when you go up to DeKalb or Fulton or any county court, tell me it ain't just like it is on TV. With all the clowning, the laughing. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's just like that. They don't know any better. They think that's the way it's supposed to go. And why is it like that? Because in 83, I think it was, Hal Becker, mm -hmm. who had just come off of about a 20-year career of brainwashing world leaders, took up a new venture, and that was television. And he said, give me television. Well, mainly, let me start right. He said, Americans don't think. They already know that. Mm -hmm. They don't think. He said, but give me television, and I will proceed to make them think what they see on television is real. And when they go out into the real world, if it's not like they saw on television, they will make it like that. And I'm Brother O.T., and I love WACP, where we are creative people for the best and the rest of your life. All right then. <laughs>